Welcome to FAR, the photographic series. In this series, we are going to guide you through cameras and photographers, their problems, their solutions and a lot more. Do keep watching. Hey friends, welcome to another episode of our the photographic series. Today we are going to talk about equipments required for baby photography. So baby photography is very different and very appealing more than the normal photography that we do in events and outdoor. For baby photography, the most important thing that we look at is concepts because babies require concepts obviously they cannot give an expression they cannot do anything great like otherwise you can tell people to do something but babies are someone you you do, they do not understand what you want from them so you have to capture them in different conceptual modes i would recommend that you always create the concepts before you go on for the shoot you discuss with the client what exactly he she wants for the baby photography take references from the internet if needed but be sure of what you want Secondly, baby photography may you should avoid flash. Flash is not a thing that you should uh, directly flash on the baby's eye because it does have adverse health effects as well. If you are continuously flashing on the baby, maybe it might affect their eyesight in a long term point of view. So I recommend not to use flash. And if you are using flash, do keep it on a bounce mode, where whereas it is hitting the ceiling and bouncing the light on the baby. For that reason, we use. low set of apertures i mean higher depth of field in which the babies get a softer tone always shoot baby on a more warmish tone making it feel more more house and friendly okay for babies getting the right moment is very important so you always have to be behind the camera ready to get the perfect moment go unlimited when you're shooting baby you might need to click 100 pictures non stop but do it because out of those 100 you will 100% get five good pictures with a baby's good smile and a soft tone picture etc so do not play too much with lighting when you're shooting baby i would say play with depth of field use a good 50 mm maybe a 1.4 or a 1.8 that would help you best to get soft tone pictures don't bother about the background it's more important that your baby's eyes are in focus so when you're shooting baby the next thing that you have to keep in mind is that go to the baby's level and shoot if you're shooting a baby on the ground level scoop down to the ground and shoot straight forward the baby should be at eye level with you and not you should not be shooting downwards or upwards to the baby wherever the baby is seated it should be exactly in level that is the first and last rule of baby photography babies are also very moody so they have their sleeping time they have their eating time you have to consider all of that for that reason you should always remove an entire day and go for a baby portfolio you should not consider that the baby will do as per what you say because they have their own schedules they have their own timings and they will do as per that only you should also consider another very important fact when you're shooting babies is try avoiding studio photography and keeping it at home that's a place where they are always comfortable because seeing a new place maybe they might get scared maybe they might not want to shoot so that that's a point of time where you might reach a point with the client that Uh, what to do with this so you should have that kind of experience that you shoot at the baby's house itself that will give you the most convenient results as per your shoot in case you have any questions any queries anything that you want to ask us please do mention it in the comment box below or you can contact us on info@bxstudio.in if you like the content of this video please make sure you like share and subscribe hey friends this is abdali roshan your very own house friendly photographer we are going to talk about a lot of camera techniques problems faced by photographers and a lot more throughout this series so do keep updated with the fire series